Grace, Grace, today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is 28th chapter, Paul the Brave Helper. Let's read the Bible story. What are you going to do? People on the ship were hopeless. What could they do? The winds were strong and the ship was going to sink. Paul has gone on the boat and the people were hopeless because the winds were so strong and the ship was going to sink. You can see the waves. The rain was pouring over the people. They were in the middle of a big storm. They couldn't do anything. We'll die soon. They were scared. To death. They were afraid because they might die of because of the storm. The big storm was came and they couldn't do anything. No, we won't die. God said we won't die, said Paul. Paul told the people about God. He told them how God would help them. So, Paul, God told Paul that no one will die in the storm. So, Paul taught them about the God news. Paul preaches the gospel bravely. Bravely, Paul knew that God would be with those who believe in Him. Saul knew that who believe in Jesus, God, that they will be alive. The storm was so violent. That the boat was wrecked. But the people were all safe because of God helped them. They were happy God was there with them. So there was a very big storm came. There was a very big storm, but They believed God, that God will save them. So God helped them to be alive. The people were very happy because they believed in Jesus and overcame the difficulties. They were happy because God sent Paul for them to give them faith. So God sent Paul to give faith to them. And they were all safe. No one has died or hurt. <laughs> Twenty-nine chapter, a letter for Onesimus. Onesimus ran away. Onesimus walked for Palemon, but Onesimus ran away from Palemon. Hmm. Onesimus was running away from Palemon. Let's see why he was running away from him. Onesimus was running away to a big city. He took something for Palamon, but God sent Paul to meet Onesimus. Onesimus was running away and God sent Paul for Onesimus. God sent Paul for Onesimus. 
Paul told Onesimus about Jesus. Onesimus began to love Jesus. He wanted to tell people about Jesus. So Paul told Onesimus about Jesus and Onesimus also began to love Jesus and wanted to tell the people about the good news and about Jesus. Paul is the helper of God. After Onesimus learned about God's love, so Paul also told Onesimus about God's love, that God loves us as of Onesimus. He wanted to go back to Palemon. Onesimus wanted Palemon to forgive him. Onesimus wanted Palemon to love him. So, Onesimus ran away from Palamon, but when he learned about God's love, he wanted to go back to Palamon, and he wanted Palamon to forgive him. Paul wrote a letter for Onesimus. Dear Palamon, Onesimus loves Jesus. Onesimus hopes that you will forgive him and take him back. So Paul sent a letter to Palamon for Onesimus. So the title is, uh, what's the title? A letter for Onesimus. Onesimus was very happy because Paul helped him. Onesimus was very happy to have a good friend like Paul. So they were friends now. He knew about God, Jesus, how God loves them. And also he was happy because he had a new friend, Paul. Let's read one more story. Story chapter, Paul sent letters. One day, someone came to Pelopin Church. A Portius came to Paul, the man of God. So he's the man of God. He became sick while he was ver- uh, he was helping Paul and the church. Paul was worried, but the new friends of the church prayed to God for a push to ship. <laughs> the juice. God helped them to be healthy again. So, the God's man, a portutus, were sick and the people prayed for him. And he was healed healthy again. Let's erase this. Just gave Paul's letter to Pelopin Church again. Paul thanked the Pelopin Church for their love in his letter. So Paul, he gave the letter of Paul to them. He wrote to his Jewish friends to make them believe in Jesus. He told them to keep their faith and told them more about Jesus. Paul is the God's man. He told about the all good things. Yesterday I read the Bible story. Today did you enjoy it? I have read three stories today. Then let's see you next time. Bye!